It occurred to us that since we left Ensenada, we hadn't docked in two months. For that time, our anchor was what kept us tethered to the world. A year ago in Montreal, we dreamed about being self-sufficient, of having an office with an ever-changing view. This past year we got our office, but because we work with laptops, power was still an issue. Our solar panels alone could not supply enough energy, so our work hours were limited to battery life. That was okay for a while, but when working on bigger projects, it can be frustrating. We finally solved this problem. Our Christmas present to ourselves was a Honda 1000 generator. Armed with the generator and our solar panels, we got all the juice we would ever need to make the studio at Anchor a reality. In January, we put our new system to the test and ran away to Balandra. Our days went something like this. In the morning, we would make coffee, turn on the generator to charge our laptops, run it for an hour while working on various projects until lunchtime. After that, work on the boat. We would then go to shore for a walk, exploring the area. While being anchored off Playa Bonanza, we released our latest game, Donsol. We used the unlimited T-Mobile data plan that we purchased in San Francisco. The plan works perfectly in Mexico, even in certain secluded anchorages. We were able to respond to comments on Itch.io and upload new builds. We also released the instruction video for Domin, a game you can play with domino pieces. Being in an anchorage surrounded by paradise did not distract us from our duties. We even found time to make sprites for friends in the style of Okoni. It's weird to think that even with all these big changes in our lives, we're not any less focused. We get just as much done. If anything, we're more relaxed. We take breaks often. We take in the world around us. It's how we stay inspired. We remember, not so long ago, sitting in a Montreal coffee shop, sipping our hot drinks and writing down goals accompanied by a series of empty boxes in a notepad. We have since filled in a lot of these boxes. As always, thank you for keeping us afloat. Literally. <laughs>